Okay, this is a new camera, so I'm not used to it whatsoever. I don't know what the lighting is like or anything. But I am at Heathrow Airport, Terminal 3. I'm currently inside the Emirates Lounge. I'm going to the Maldives with Benefit, which is pretty insane. Um, everyone else is here, they're all chilling together. I've brought my mum as my plus one. It was her birthday yesterday, so I thought, what a better way to top off a birthday and what way to tell the woman that birthed me I appreciate her, you know? This is gonna be a really good time. We were running so late, but um, we're here now, so it's fine. We've just got a drink. I'm just gonna pick up some food because I didn't eat anything. I packed this morning. I was doing some work yesterday till late. I was tired, delirious, couldn't pack, um, but I packed this morning and was running really late, but I'm here, so that's all that matters, right? Hello, mum. <laughs> so we're on the flight. We have a business class flight. I've never flown business class before, so I'm feeling bougie. Bougie. You feeling bougie, mum? If she, if she annoys me, I can just... <laughs> she really annoys me, so you can be bad. Um, but yeah, we've got a little drink corner here, which is really cute. Yeah. This bit, you we can lie down. I've never, I've never been able to sleep on a flight. And now I have a bed, full on bed. What is this like? I'm here for it. This is how I feel like I'm always going to need to fly now. But yeah, Mum and I will be enjoying this flight. We're going to Dubai and then from Dubai to the Maldives. Oh, we've got a menu and the food. In a, let me tell you about economy life, yeah. Okay, so I've got a mini story for you guys. I left this camera on the plane. I realised like half an hour, 45 minutes after I got off the plane and burst into tears i bought this camera like two days ago so it wasn't it wasn't ideal really but um they got it back i'm so happy i feel so lucky basically she said that they might have to send it to the maldives or collect it when i come back and just i need the camera to work obviously but they got it i'm happy <laughs> We're currently in the um, the business lounge, just waiting for our connecting flight to the Maldives. We're in Dubai right now, and I had the best sleep ever on the plane. Like it was amazing. Like we don't even mind going on another flight. That's how good it was. So yes. show you guys the room when we get back well not when we get back but tomorrow as you can see all in the daytime and stuff um right now we are going to a barbecue beach party with all the gals and everything from one of these buggy things how are you feeling i'm feeling great yeah really? i like these earrings with the outfit oh thank you so yeah fun times <laughs> Jay's getting ready. Hey guys. <laughs> We've just got um, breakfast ordered to the room. So we're gonna eat there. I'm getting ready. We were meant to go on a boat party tonight. Not not tonight, this morning. But um, the weather is not too good right now. But the man said that it should improve a little bit later. So hopefully it does. But yeah, just for now, we're gonna get ready. Chill. Breakfast. <laughs> Hi you guys, say hi mum. Hiya! <laughs> so, this morning we woke up and it was really really bad weather. Still hot but 
it was raining. Um, hello! <laughs> so, it was really, really bad weather. But, um, that was Patricia that I was saying hi to. <laughs> Careful, Mum, you're too close to the edge, it scares me. Oh, shit. Um, so anyway, the weather was bad, so the boat party got cancelled this morning, but the weather is getting better now, so the boat party is still going ahead. Um, we're just walking to meet everyone now. We're having such a good time, aren't we, Mum? Without a doubt. We don't want to go. This is like the best holiday I've ever been on in my life. Best trip I've ever been on. So, yeah, and yeah. Party. It was really good for a couple of hours and then afterwards I started to feel really really sick like I'm just not really good with traveling. I'm not good with boats and things like that And it, especially when it was just sat there like swaying from side to side I started to feel really really sick um, We had food on there and just caught up got to know some of the girls I haven't known before um, Now we're just at back at our villa Chilling. I can't even speak. I'm so sorry <laughs> I can literally, I'm so tired. Look at my hair though. So basically, long story short, my mum took up my, hello. You can stay oh see God. you. Sorry. Doesn't matter. They love, they love your appearances. <laughs> um, so long story short, um, I put extensions in. I had them in for like, I don't know, a week before I came here anyway. Um, because I wanted like long, beachy hair. But I didn't realise how much humidity there would be in the air here. So every time I went out, well, like yesterday and stuff, and in the daytime, my hair was so frizzy at the top. My hair was so, like, curly, and the extensions were still straight. And then the extensions started to get really, like, knotty and just... Just started to feel like... I don't know how to explain just stuck. Like, just... They were nice because of the weather and stuff. So I got my mum to take up my weave yesterday, and look at my hair. Can we talk about this? It looks amazing, I'm not gonna lie. I love my hair right now. This is how I want my hair to always be, and this is how my hair used to be until I kill it with heat damage, and the only way it can get like this is when I'm on holiday now. You're gonna have to live in a hot country. I don't think I could live in a hot country. You'll be all right, June. I, I don't think I could live in a hot country because I feel like I'd be way too relaxed all the time. Because I'm in the UK and I'm cold, and like, there's nothing to really do, you might as well work. So, I feel like if I was to live in here. Work, 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 work. You see me everywhere. Work, 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 work. <laughs> tomorrow we have a free day on all day. So, I'm hoping the weather is a lot better tomorrow because there hasn't been much sun today. It's still warm, but there hasn't been much sun. So, tomorrow I'm going to get lots of Instagram content. And then in the evening, we have the grand reveal of basically the new product. As to why we're out here they're bringing out a new product it's hashtag out of this world they've given us that's the only clue out of this, out of this world and they've given, they've put like a little spaceship girl so on the window so i'm guessing it has something to do with space i'm not sure i have not i've been guessing and guessing what this product could be i think it's brow product because benefit are just so big with brows i love their brow products so much mum thinks it's eyeshadow a lot of girls think it's highlighter um, but we will see we will see um and you guys will see okay see you guys soon 
got ice cream guys, I've got vanilla and raspberry sorbet and it's very very nice. I put a cone, basically long story short, I had ice cream with a cone earlier but I wanted to try several ice creams so I got a cone but I always like, I mean I've got a cups but I always like a cone so I just stuck a cone on top and now I can just... So we went to dinner. I didn't bring you guys along with me because I was just so tired and grumpy. I was so jet lagged. It was nice. So this boob tube dress that I have on is from a company called Slinger. And then my mum's dress is from a Pretty Little Thing. <laughs> Hi guys. Mum and I are now leaving our villa. Um, we're going to go get some lunch and I'm going to come back and do some Instagram content. Beautiful. Um, Patricia, you are shining. Shining, 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 shining. Lady in the red dress. Oh, you know me, guys. Lady in the red dress. Oh, thank you. you. Without further ado, I'm going to hand you over to the OG of Benefit Cosmetics, Miss Julie Bell, who's the Vice President of Product Marketing. And a massive thank you to her for being here with us tonight. We're very privileged. We're not worthy, Julie. No. <laughs> On behalf of everyone in the beauty industry, you are doing something that is so extraordinary. You are walking the talk of empowering girls. And I hope you're super, super proud of yourselves because of all the great and hard work you do, our industry is thriving. We are like the best industry to be in. We get to have fun, right? Yeah. We get to be creative. And most important of all, we get to make girls feel better about themselves. Um, this is an innovative product that we are beyond, beyond excited and proud of. So party down, have a great time, and make new friends. Thank you.
are about to have some brekkie for the last time. How good does this look? Okay guys, I'm gonna show you around this villa. It is literally the most insane thing you will ever see. Me and mum, when we walked in here, we were like, like wow, like this is pure luxury. Like I'd be happy to like die here. So this is the outside. This is the front of the villa. Has a seating area here. It has this dining area here we just had breakfast here and it was delicious and then this i love this you can see the ocean this little space woman this is for the out of the world um event for their mascara launch that we now know about and then in here toilet and you know while you're doing your business why don't you just look at the ocean? Oh, there's a... Mum, come have a look at this. Come here. Where are you? In the toilet. Oh, gosh. There's a crabby. Cute. Walk through this way. This is obviously the bedroom. In this trunk is actually um, a TV. And you can see all the outside in here. And then through this door, it's like a little, it's like a little chill area. They said it's mostly for kids. The kids like to chill out here. And when he said that, I was like, oh, little Ayla, I could just imagine her sitting down there. I miss her a lot, guys. Through here is another toilet. And then through here is like a dressing dressing room type thing. This does light up, actually. Through here is the shower. This is the indoor shower. And then you can come out this way. And here is an outdoor shower. This is the sea, but you have like your own bit that's blocked off. But yeah, you can have a little dip in the sea. This bath, me and mum took some photographs here. Looked really, really cute. Come through here. Mum's just doing her makeup. Say hey. 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 This is, we've got double sinks. I love double sinks because I hate sharing like bathroom space. Another bit where you could just view the ocean. We took some Polaroids. You know me, I'm a little bit daring, guys. So that is the downstairs. Let me go outside for you. Oh, and this bit, I forgot to show you this bit. This is like a little office -y bit. How cute. Imagine editing YouTube videos there. Actual goals. Have a little seating area there and I'm going to take you upstairs. And this is like the upstairs seating area. You can have breakfast here if you want to and then there's a slide. A freaking slide in your villa, how insane is that? I'm going to show you guys the part that I loved. And they showed it to me, I was like, what? Inside the drawer, you push this button. And you know, casually the ceiling just opens. How insane is that? We're going to go to the PR's villa. Their villa is like a five bedroom villa. It's like a hundred thousand pound a week it is wild. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go there. I need to just do a couple more pictures. Look at this mosquito bite. Like why? I've literally got mosquito bites everywhere. Let me get the light in, can you see? Anyway, we're gonna go to the other villa. 
Got a nice lunch setting at the beach. How beautiful is this? It's so lovely. So we have now got on the boat, finished from the beach. We're on our way to the, the villa. We're gonna get fresh and dub and then basically get ready to go back on the plane. We're so sad to leave. I don't want to go, it's the best trip of my life. <laughs> Alright, so we have checked out, we are about to leave. It's a sad day for us all. Very sad. It's a sad day. But we're very, very grateful to even have this experience in the first place. Yeah. Definitely don't, don't want to go home, but you know. And yeah, there will be other times, other trips. I hope so. There will be, don't worry, hon. Thank you. Thank you very much. 